Hey everybody, welcome back to Straight Talk. So today I wanna to talk to you about representing the company you own or the company you work for. You think nothing of it, you need a cup of coffee or you need a quick lunch, you're wearing your work t-shirt or you're driving your company truck and you stop in somewhere. What you don't realize or what you should realize is everything you do while wearing your company logo is advertising for your company. So how you act, how you respond, and how you behave directly relates to how people are going to see your company. I wanna give you a scenario of something I witnessed recently and why I will never hire that company. And I'm pretty sure everybody in line at the coffee shop feels the same way. So here we go. It's lunchtime, okay? Um, a very small town I live in, but it's lunchtime and we're in the one coffee shop. Everybody goes there. Everybody knows everybody and we go there. So we're all in line. I'm about third or fourth one back. And there's a gentleman up front wearing a bright orange company t-shirt with the company logo on the front and his name and the company logo on the whole back. So he proceeds to be very rude to the employee, informing her that he doesn't like the fact that she's the only one at the counter. It's lunchtime and there should be more employees. He doesn't like the fact that he's late and she needs to hurry up and get his lunch. So she's nothing but sweet. Yes, sir, I understand. We had somebody call in sick. We're doing the best we can. What can I get you for lunch? Now, mind you, he already has wasted a couple minutes of his lunch hour that he's late for, reprimanding her for not doing her job correctly. So he gives her the order. She takes his order down and then realizes there's other, behind, other people behind him. So she slides the order over on the counter and proceeds to take the next order. Well, with that, he loses his mind. He starts screaming at her. This is not very efficient. I was first, you should complete my order before you move on to the next person. Well, it turns out that's the process they have. She writes down the order, slides it over there. The next employee comes from the back, fills the order and completes the transaction. It's about two minutes later, his sandwich is up, he's ready to go, and he yells back to the girl behind the counter, I see you have a tip jar there. Well, that's ridiculous. With the way you people are running this business, if you think we're leaving tips, you got another thing coming. Now the rest of us in line were just sort of like quietly observing how he was behaving and um, noticing the company he worked for. I don't know about you, but I hire companies, especially local businesses, based on personality, um, you know, not only on their work ethic, but on how you treat other people, right? So I have already formed a, an opinion. I will never hire this person. He, it was a uh, seal coating company. I will never hire this person for seal coating, period. I will call every other seal coating company in the area before I call that person. And I'm pretty sure many of the people in line with me were thinking the same thing because you know how you look at each other and you have the same idea. So he grabs his lunch, he walks out, and he gets in his company truck. So now there's no doubt for any of us that that person works for that company. And I'm pretty sure he was the owner um, just from knowing him around. But anyway, others might not know that. But so he's representing the company. He's not only wearing the logo, he's driving the logo. And he just showed everybody in that coffee shop how he treats other people. So are you gonna hire somebody that treats other people that way? I get it, you're late, you're stressed, but that poor girl was doing her best and she did not deserve you to talk to her that way. So if you talk to her that way, how are you gonna talk to me if I call and would like your services? So long story short, treat others the way you would like to be treated, especially when you're representing your own company. There you go, there's some straight talk. I'll see you next time.